Alright, so check this shit out. I'm coming in here back at this fucking last base. And this time, guess what? I came prepared, bitch. I put in the work at the arena. Got the Bushman. So now I'm playing in the pubic hairs and I can fucking complete this bitch. No problem. At least that's the plan. I definitely did take a fuckload of attempts before this. But guess what? We're going to complete it this time. Scouting out the area. I already did my roll for luck. And now I'm ready to take some pot shots at some bitches. I'm looking at this guy. He's moving around a whole lot. I'm not really certain. But guess what? We're going to take him down. And nobody's going to notice. Because nobody gave a fuck about that motherfucker. Now this hill looks kind of intimidating. But I think I could probably make it down. Considering I have about a thousand times before this. Did a nice little water slide down the rest of it. Now we're going to walk over this nice corrugated roof. Look at this guy for a while. Because he seems really interesting. But... Guess what he's not, and look at this bastard. Comes to look out the window, and guess what? His peripherals aren't as good as you wish as they were. I try and drag him, but this bitch is really fat, so I just kind of left him there. Now, I peek out of this doorway. Nobody's there, fortunately, because otherwise I would have got my ass handed to me because I really wasn't prepared. Check his outpost, but I knew he was dead anyways, but I didn't want to take any fucking risks. I was ready to complete this bitch. And... Alright, so we've got the bonfires emitting... Uh, extreme I don't even know how to describe the amount of black smoke that's coming off of it but that's what's happening do you activate the alarm because I can because why not just better to be safe even though I'm just gonna kill myself if I don't do this undetected I'm gonna climb up this ladder I'm using my x-ray vision to check out this guy right here I'm not sure what he's doing but he's not looking my way so I think I can climb up hide behind this little fucking uh, whatever the fuck you want to call it peek out and holy shit I don't know how he didn't see me I guess he thought I was some kind of bullfrog so I just he just uh you know paid it no attention but that was his mistake because I came out and stabbed that bitch now he's dead out of the view of his friends I'm thinking there should be more people at this base considering how goddamn hard it is but I guess not these people are just professionals but not today I guess they were taking it slow they didn't expect AJ to come in in this bitch Deactivate this one just for shits and fiddles because, once again, it's better to be safe. Walk over here. It suggests that I uh, change my gun to whatever shitbox he had, but I'm not going to do that because I worked hard for this gun. I see this guy. I've never seen him up here before. I'm wondering, why the fuck did he choose today on my perfect day where I'm going to get this shit undetected to go have a nice sit down by the campfire maybe make some s'mores? But I'm not going to let that put a damper on my pamper, so I'm just going to kind of crawl around for a little while. I noticed those bells there that, are, that I never figured out what the fuck they're for. Some sort of Chinese ancient relic, but they're there and I think they look nice. So uh, I'm thinking about exchanging my wicker basket for that kind of protection. It's a little bit better. I'm hiding. They're doing a pretty good job. I'm still not exactly sure what I'm going to do, but I'm really giving it a good a good scout out now I could just take this bitch down right here probably throw a throwing knife at those two assholes and call it a day but I'm not going to do that because I'd probably get my ass handed to me now the dance brothers over here are doing their routine one's practicing their uh, choreography the other one's doing push ups to make sure he can uh, I don't know jack off his dick more often but I'm not going to question it I know is their, their uh, triplet is up there making s'mores so I'm not going to worry about that. This guy stands up. He thinks he hears something, but he's either deaf or uh, uh, hypersensitive. I don't fucking know. One or the other. One side of the spectrum. He goes back to his workout because he's got to get 6,000 push-ups in. Otherwise, holy shit. All right, that was a ballsy move, but I took it. Now I got to take this guy out. Now guess what? I'm getting attacked on all the days by a fucking leopard or... Whatever the shit this asshole is. But guess what? I just knife it until he dies. Now they know I'm here. That guy really fucked up. I thought it was going to be a perfect run. Not even know I was ever here. But my hopes and dreams were crushed as soon as that kitty cat decided he wanted to play. So I kill that guy. Now I'm pretty excited because these guys are not grouped up very well. And it's just these two assholes left. I'm still not believing that there's no heavies in here. That was a very sloppy move. But guess what? got the job done this guy's coming through here and look at this I shoot over his left shoulder 
and he decides just to kill himself because he can't take that type of shit. Now the outpost is uh, liberated and we just kind of get a nice little flyby with some pretty pink colors. And that's the end of that. So uh, thanks for watching. If you needed to know how to liberate this last base undetected, 100% undetected, that's how you do it. Thanks for watching the video. Please like and maybe subscribe. Bye bye.